Hello everyone. Content of this video is focused on one and one point only. And that is, should you exercise the warrant before January 26, 2024 to get bonus share? Yes or no, right? So what you will see in this video is detailed mathematical analysis and conclusion. My findings and conclusion will surprise you. And also it will provide you guidance to make a profitable decision. So hope you stick around till the end to see the conclusion. So one request, please share, subscribe, like, comment with your friends and family one more thing disclaimer i am not a financial advisor neither do i recommend any trade this video is for educational purpose only okay so let's move on all right so anyone who has a sava warrant in their portfolio should have received a notification from their brokerage house. Since I have uh, an account with Charles Schwab, so this is what I got from Charles Schwab. Now, if you read this message, right, what is the summary of this? But the summary is that you must submit request on or before January 26, 2024 to get bonus share. So if you want bonus share to be allocated to you, then you must exercise your warrant before Jan 26. And you know, you all know the, the warrant details is $33 per, per share. So let's okay here it is right let's suppose for a moment or just assume that you have 100 warrants in your portfolio and you decided to exercise it now as the terms of the warrant right if you go back and look at the terms of the warrant for 100 warrants will be converted into 100 Sava share at $33 each. So your brokerage house will take 100 warrants from you. They will work with Sava and issue 100 Sava share at $33 each, which will be $3,300 that will be deducted from your brokerage accounts. Now, since you are exercising it before January 26, 2024, which is just a few weeks away from now, within a few weeks, then you will get 50 extra share, right? So, which is bonus. So, let's summarize it. So, what you did is you gave your 100 warrants to the brokerage house and in return you got 150 sava share and you pay total 3300 and if you convert that 3300 to 150 it comes out to be around 22 dollars now the question is is it really the 22 dollars or there are something we missing from this calculation so i will come to that in a minute but right now it looks so cool, right? If you go back, look at the price of the share. Friday is $26.24. And you only paid $22. You converted your warrants into the Sava share and it cost you $22. The price of the stock is $26. So you make, seems like, seems like, let, let me just repeat it seems like you're making four dollar each share you know that probably gonna make you feel happy but is that 
is what it is or there is something that we are missing and that is what i will be talking about in the next uh, few, few minutes so let's move on to the data analysis all right so this is the most fun and exciting part of the video and i must say this is the most profitable part of the video this is where we will be doing the mathematical analysis to see if really we paying 22 dollars or there is some hidden money that we are paying and we are just not paying attention to that so let, let's do this let's assume that you own 100 warrant in your portfolio now what you decided is to exercise it through your brokerage you gave them 100 warrants and in return they gave you 100 stock sava stock at 33 dollar each and three thousand three hundred dollar was deducted from your brokerage account now since you are exercising it before jan 26 24 which is just few weeks away so you got 50 extra share so the total you receive is 150 share and you paid three thousand three hundred dollars so if you average it out it comes out to 22 dollars each so you took your 100 warrants and you exercise it before january 26 so you got 150 share at a price of 33 dollars and the cost per share is 22 dollars now so far this looks so exciting right because when you go back and look at the, the price for those uh, what you call it uh, sawa sawa closed on friday at 26 dollar 24 cents right and, and you are getting it 22 so this looks very interesting but there are some hidden charges or, or I shouldn't say hidden charges but there is one thing that most of us are actually overlooking it what you're doing over here is you're giving away your 100 warrants to your your brokerage house in exchange for this uh, sour share now those warrant has a value on it so if you look at this warrant right sour warrant it has a value of nine dollar on friday each sour warrant has nine dollar value on so those hundred warrant that you gave to your brokerage house has nine hundred dollar value so in other words three thousand three hundred dollar was deducted from your brokerage account plus nine hundred dollar worth of warrant was given to the brokerage house so in reality you paid forty two hundred dollar right thirty three hundred plus nine hundred four thousand two hundred dollar total was 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 paid to it so now this doesn't look as good as it was before right before it seemed like twenty two dollar but most of us overlook the price of the warrant so if you add both of those 3300 the money detected from brokerage account 900 the warrant value 4200 so what you paid for each share is not 22 dollars 28 dollars that was the cost per share if you add the income from the warrant now when we go back and look at the price for the sawa if you look at the price of the sawa on the friday it was 26 dollar 24 cents so if i go back and buy 150 share from the market at 26.43 i'm only paying 3964 dollar but when i exercise my option uh, well it's not an option it's a warrant 
I'm paying $4,200. So what that means is I'm paying $235 extra, a dollar fifty-seven over each year. So at this point, it is better for me to just sell the option. Well, actually, I'm not sure why I keep saying the option. Better for me to sell the warrant in the open market and get that cash and buy Sava share from just open market. At this time, it does not make any sense for me, at least, to exercise the warrant through my brokerage to get the share. So let me just do one more thing over here. So I'll, I'll, let me show you one thing over here. That's, uh, okay, good. So I do know that most of you have a different number of warrant. And also the price of the warrant is going to be changing day on daily basis. And the price of the stock will be changing on a daily basis too. So this is the template I created. If you want a copy of this template, please put it on your in my comment section. I will be more than happy to upload it over there if I have enough com comment and request for this. So let's take an example. Instead of 100, you have 200 Sava warrants. So everything will change. You see that? It is all change. $20. 200. Now let's suppose instead of warrant, $9 is changed to $8 is changed. So all you need to do is the three, the blue one, just change it and it will give you an idea. Let's suppose the stock price is 25. You see that you just change the quantity of warrant you have. The price of the warrant on the open market and the price of the sub on the open market and you will get a true picture of what is more profitable is it profitable to just sell the warrant in the open market and buy the, the sava separately or go through the exercise process and get the bonus so to me at this time It does not make sense you know my <laughs> my strategy is to buy low and sell high i do not want to pay for something extra for no reason right so let's suppose if you have 300 of this in sour you see the difference it makes but then again it depends what the price of this is right so you just all these three you keep changing the value to get that so hopefully i make it very clear and you did understand why I said in the beginning that it's not the $22 that you are paying for the share. You are paying more than that and that based on the price of the warrant too. So hoping that you like the video. So if you have any question, concerns, please put it in the comment section. And please don't forget to share, subscribe, like. So hope to see you soon with some other new videos. Thank you. And hope.